thought because I thought Elon Musk gave you a Neuralink, bro. Because well, like, yeah, way yeah. too smart. I, I'm curious uh, though. With I what, would love one, by the way. <laughs> after, after the first couple thousand go through, I want one. Yeah. You put one in? Oh, one hundred. I would. Why not? The, the thing is, what's Locked interesting, in. which I why wouldn't you? Once you uh, the Neuralink actually works, and you convince symbiosis with technology and just download things to your brain, you'll be able to make so much money that it doesn't matter how much the procedure will cost. Anyone will be able to afford it, essentially. Um, so I think like the first few like would probably go for an absurd amount of money, right? Because like even if you had zero dollars, you could just hypothetically borrow a hundred thousand dollars, get it? Because once you have infinite, you know, bandwidth to unlimited knowledge, you could make unlimited money. It um, doesn't scare you at all. No, you're like pretty much a robot at that point. Yeah, though, but no? we already are. How much? How like fucking? But not really. Screen- you can you can turn your yeah. Phone but look off at like your that. screen time. How much time a day do you? Probably spend a lot. On it? Yeah, but not 24 hours. Yeah, but five hours. So five hours a day, you're staring at it. The only difference is instead of having the input lag of your thumbs, it's just instant, which would be much more But there's more still, optimal. before phones, there was a complete escape. Now there's still somewhat of an escape. You can yeah. put your phone down. True. But when it's in your brain, that's just, now it's, like you said, it's a complete upload yeah. download. You're going like, to like be making chicken and instead of Googling a recipe, it'll just pop in your head. It's crazy. I think like just making people less human. Probably. For sure. Yeah. I well, that's really what it does. thought into it. I mean, I think on a large I think about scale all this too, weird shit. Like, I'm kind well, of weird. That's well, imagine we, every human has it, and then like, I mean, I'm not conspiracy, but like, the government pretty much like knows off, what everyone's know, <laughs> thinking. Yeah. yeah, if yeah. everyone has it, then no one's you have a chip anymore. in your brain. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty scary. A lot to think about there. Yeah, because there's a lot of benefits. Like, not even have like I could just talk to you in a heart like in a second. Literally, I could be on the other side of the world and just think, oh no, and and then there you go. We probably could have consumed this whole podcast and like. Yeah, exactly. And our literally lips, had all our lips would be closed and we'd just be communicating through heads. Yeah. yeah. That doesn't scare you a little bit? I mean, it does, but yeah. like, I'm sure the fucking phones terrified motherfuckers, you know, 20 years I ago. I think it's going to be like how our grandparents are like, I don't need a phone. So I just think of shit. Yeah, so, I don't need a goddamn like, Neuralink. And the we might be those people that are like, yo, I don't need a Neuralink. And they're like, Grandpa, you're a fucking loser. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Dude, I'm crazy, so excited though. to see how that happens. I think I got a little taste of that with TikTok because I'm not like super up to date on like all the mini TikTokers that are blowing up and the drama. Um, but I'm like, as we age, I'm so curious where we're going to become the fucking boomers. And like all the little kids are just going to be like, you guys are fucking idiots and don't understand anything. You don't understand culture. Like, so I feel like we'll always be part of culture, but there's definitely going to be a day where we just have no fucking yeah, clue what's going that's on. That's inevitable sure. for sure. Yeah. 